All right, so fuck is up, guys. This is going to be new Super Mario Brothers U, which is what the little updated Wii U chat thing was going to be. Uh, about spot pass. Spot pass users will be able to. Okay. Yeah, activate it. I'm pretty excited about Wii U. Everything's been pretty cool. And I was telling a story in the last video, and I'll get back to it at some point. Might be in my best interest to turn the gamepad down. Because I don't need double the echo. I'm probably going to play this all in my hand. I'm pretty sure it's just the exact same shit that's on the TV. And what's on the TV is hard to see because it's blocked by stuff from where I'm sitting. So, uh, yeah, we'll use the first one. No, I want to play with the gamepad. We're getting story mode. So, yeah, I'm really looking forward to this game. Should be plenty of awesome in here. Big Mario fan. And it. Okay, let's watch the little cutscene. With some of the best music ever. I wonder who that is. Wow, his his kids have their own ships now. That that's cute, I guess. Or I shouldn't say his kids, the uh, Koopalings or whatever. I'm sorry, I just wow. Such violence, Nintendo. Um, I just don't understand why I'm not complaining, but everything looks so much better on the gamepad, and I was using an an HD TV. When I first played Black Ops, and it still just looks so pretty in the gameplay. I'm not, I'm not complaining at all. That's awesome. It's just something about how it's compressed, I guess. Like honestly, I, I really enjoy just playing shit on this gamepad. But all right. Well, acorns are plenty. Acorns are plenty indeed, and we're stupid far away from. Uh, Okay, so that explains the, the yeah, they, they really took it back old school as far as the, the manual and stuff, which made me happy for this game. There's a map in there and stuff, and that's just Nostalgia Fest 2012 right there. Uh, I guess this, yeah, we're fighting him first. He's coming over here to sound like Nelson from The Simpsons. Yeah, this is awesome. This is really awesome. I think that's boom boom. Does my computer go to sleep? Acorn planes. I uh, can't do anything here again. But anyway, yeah, they uh they got the continuous world map. Oh yeah, I'm gonna we're gonna have fun with this. Excuse me while I get accustomed to the controls. I do, I don't need this second game. No, I don't need the second uh control stick. All right. Yeah, I'm totally not looking at the TV. I'm just gonna look at the gamepad. It's a lot easier from here. Oh crap! Wait. These guys just have goodies for me. Uh, how do I run? I have to learn the. Okay, I have to hold this to run. All right, just give me a second to learn controls. You know, because even though I know the gamepad a little bit now from Black Ops, I don't know the Mario controls. I need that guy to come back and give me an acorn. He's like the little weird Koopa things, the little weird naked Koopas with the cape from Donut Plains and Super Mario World. I'm uh. I'm a bit of a okay. Fine then. Fuck you, guy. I don't need you to come back. So do I, I shake the I shake the gamepad to do stuff? It'd be cool if I didn't have this charger cable in the way. Then also that might pop back out and get me. So I'm gonna just throw it. But yeah, we we might go for. Whoa, wasn't expecting all that. We might go for the uh, all the star coins. It just depends. Uh, I know this is like a pretty pretty big game I believe compared to the other ones but uh, it's cool wouldn't mind doing a bunch of videos on it it just probably end up taking the place of Mario hacks to be honest if it starts to go on for a long time I just want to do Mario hacks so that'd be a lot of Mario on the channel I got Super Moogle World or I believe is the current Mario hack we were on and then I have uh, at the Super Mario Star Road the, what the hell is that another no it's just these all right I got Super Moogle World, and I got uh, Super Mario Star Road. The freaking... There's shit up there, isn't there? I don't know. It was just that much for that. Star Road, the uh, freaking Super Mario 64 hack, if I could complete a th thought. And if I could talk as well. And that's a secret down there. But yeah. um, I don't even remember the story that I was attempting to tell last time, which is mighty depressing. But I'm trying to get used to this squirrel suit, and I'm hella distracted. I don't know why it's so wow. 
why it's so hard to play Mario and talk all of a sudden. I mean, I know I do this in Mario Hacks too, but it's not usually this bad, is it? Like, am I really ADD nom that bad? Uh, would like to hit that brick, please. Let me see if I can. Okay, there was nothing in it. I just thought because it was so hard to hit, there was a chance it was going to be like a one-up or something. But we'll get the we'll get the little flag. Do do do. I hope the gamepad doesn't cause too much echo. And I don't know if I have an item reserve. That would be cool to know. Also, the little rings, the red coins come out, look like fire or something now. So there, there's that fruit cake. All right. Yeah, I thought about it. Like maybe I need these platforms to get the coins. Everything's relatively easy though, because it's the first world. Well, at least I get one back. Come here, acorn mushroom. All right. I haven't seen another star coin in a minute though. I miss the item reserve boxes. I liked having an item on hold. That was like a main mechanic of Mario for me. And it's gone. I assume. I assume. A little. But anyway, as I was attempting to say, yeah, they uh, uh, don't know how I'm really supposed to glide that long. Well, there was a star coin I missed. Ah, uh, can I go back and do that? I just jump in the middle and get the star coin if possible. Yeah, thank you. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, yeah, everybody was in. We were in GameStop, and everybody was just buying accessories and shit and geeking over them. So I went on ahead and bought a Pro Controller and uh, started playing Black Ops with it. I mean, it's comfortable. Like, it really is. It just takes a minute to get used to it, especially if you have 360 on the brain. It takes a little bit to get used to the buttons being at the bottom. And it, I guess because it's more controller, like a regular controller, it is a little bit more comfortable than a gamepad. But honestly, the gamepad is really comfortable. It just looks awkward. It takes a second to wrap your brain around. It's really comfortable. And I feel like I play better with the gamepad than I do with the pro controller, which makes me sad on the inside. And we missed the... How do you miss a freaking star coin on the first level? Uh, don't know if I'll redo it just to get that. I'm probably just going to move on because... It's going to be like the first video or so, and I'm sure people want to see levels aplenty. I might come back and get that one off time. I might, after I complete the walk through the level, make a little series of trying to get them all. What is this? The camera moved out and it confused me. But, uh, yeah, the game is, this game is visually really cool. I feel like there's secrets or something around. Nope, can't walk in any walls. Cool. I'm enjoying the uh, I'm enjoying the, the Mario and HD ness of this. Even though people are like, oh, it's just Super Mario Bros. rehash and blah blah blah. And I, I I definitely respect the opinions that it's like it's starting to seem like the same thing. I feel like there are a couple things Nintendo could do to make it fresh, but honestly, if you love Mario and just the spirit of it all, you can still see where there's the plenty of differences and fun to be had and whatnot and shittery, so you'll still have a good time, I'm sure. Can I check that? Yeah. I have to remember the gamepad has these gyro sensors and stuff. Okay, and I also have to remember things will do that. Also, this sounds... I'm assuming it's new Super Mario Brothers music, but for some reason it just reminds me of Paper Mario. The background is really cool. Um, yeah. Alright. Background is really, really cool. But, I feel like I hear... It's just, uh, I guess it's just that little hollow noise that happens every once in a while. It just reminded me of being at the, the Thousand Year Door and the Paper Mario Thousand Year Door for GameCube. Just that little roam. I think maybe that's it because for some reason I'm getting one of those vibes. I really can't wait for the Paper Mario that ends up, that inevitably comes to Wii U. They have to do it. That and Smash Brothers is going to be so sexy on this thing. This thing did not disappoint me so far. Which, uh, I'm surprised. I was like, I pre-ordered it and put quite a bit of money into it. But, honestly, the whole time I just had this, this, like, large amount of skepticism due to the Wii. And the Wii was, like, the last console to come out as I was, like, still a child, I guess I could say. So, like, I had this, like, blind hope in Nintendo. And I got let down, and so I'm like, all right, and I'm older now, so I'm into more mature games, etc., etc. 
And I don't live with my mother, so I can uh, now play whatever I want, really. But, uh, you know, I was just like, I'm still going to get this because I still like Nintendo. But I'm just feeling like it's going to be like, especially when people kept saying it was less powerful than the 360 and PS3. Uh, after dealing with it, I feel like there's a very good chance that that 19 times more powerful thing could technically be. No, how the hell would you do that? Honestly, how would I go about getting that to go up there? I'd have to throw a shell at it or something. Well, crap. Oh, we're catching things we missed. Or, well, we're missing things all over the place, but at least I figured out how to rectify that when I come back here. Yep. Ah. Uh, last one, last one. Got it. Little mosquito thing. If you don't get away from me, I'm going to shoot your mom. But anyway, yeah, I'll be doing Black Ops later. I'll be doing Nintendo Land later. I might have a another game or two depending on what I spend my money on uh, to to uh, play coming soon but I figured it doesn't make sense to upload them all I just do two at a time anyway it doesn't make sense to do them all the same day because there will be too much going on on the channel with Fallout and other things which speaking of Fallout I got like seven videos of that that I still have not uploaded and I should have made that I really should have made that I got plenty of uh, Fallout just sitting there. It's like seven vids or so. I might have fixed the as aspect ratio issues on that one. Because that first set, even though it's like aspect change, one of the episodes, that first set was definitely all in, like I said, one set. So, what's happening here? Wow. Oh, Bowser's in there getting it in, and... We got a mushroom house. I think I'm going to save that. And we got to go take down Boom Boom. He's coming down here to get us. Crushing Cog's Tower. But, uh, I feel like one thing they can do to refresh this series, this entire game series, would be brand a little bit better. Like, I get the scheme they're going for. There's nothing wrong with it. If that's really what they want to do, then fine, whatever. Ice Flower, fuck yeah, that's, I like the Ice Flower. Uh, kind of better than the fire flower, especially in these levels, because you can do this. And I don't remember how to... Yeah, there we go. Oh, well, there we go. He's dead either way. Uh, they could brand a little better. Just a little bit. Like, I, there's nothing wrong with the thing. I get the order they're doing. Like, a lot of people were confused why they had New Super Mario Brothers and New Super Mario Brothers Wii. And then the other one, the third one to come out was New Super Mario Brothers 2. But they're doing it like the DS is the... Is one series and the consoles are the other so we and and you you was the sequel to new super Mario brothers we and two being the sequel to one on the ds so i get it but honestly for this one since they they seem like they wanted to get a little bit back to super mario world i think new super mario world needs to be done i just think that needs to be a game maybe if they they make another one on this system i don't think they will because they got so much flack for announcing two at the same time and then they went on ahead and said that they only do one per console and they just had two new consoles so they had two to make etc but i think if they did really getting back to super mario world things would be awesome i promise you it would get a lot of people to buy it for nostalgia purposes and then you know the game would obviously be awesome because super mario world is awesome so Super Mario World is honestly probably one of the best Mario games ever. And if you don't know what Super Mario World is, uh, I can say look it up or stick around the channel because at some point I'm going to do a walkthrough of it. Or just look at any of the Mario hack things on there. Those are like fan games created using Super Mario World as an engine. Because that's how awesome it is that people want to keep making more of it. Okay, that almost ended badly. Yeah, you know what? I get why they call call this call Crushing Tower. Alright, I want to kill that guy just because. Then I want to live just because, you know, I'm not too fond of dying. And I'm a coin whore, so deal with it. Uh, one coin I have to get. Okay. Yeah, I was a little worried. People said New Super Mario Brothers 2 was fun, though, and now they're kind of going back on that, which is weird. I didn't really get to play too much of it. I thought the idea of coins everywhere was just a stupid, cheesy gimmick and uh, wasn't excited about it. I also don't have a 
3DS, so there's nothing I could do about it. If I, oh, I definitely thought I could go in. Oh, it's that. It's that right there. I have to be able to go in uh, somewhere. Cool. I have to be able to go in somewhere because I see that there's a fucking coin in there. Alright. Hey, items. Maybe I can use... Maybe I can only use my items in the overworld? I don't know. Or maybe I just win them from doing stuff and then I can use them. But we're Tiny Mario now, so... Mushroom. And we can't kill that guy. Whatever. Alright, maybe I should not be such a coin whore. Yep, that almost ended badly. As I say I should not be such a coin whore, I notice that I'm still whoring for the coins. Oh, that almost ended really badly. Okay, is it this? Yeah, it's this. 